A lot of us have been discussing whether that was out and uh, did he actually come in the line of the throw. And I do believe that he did change his line of running. He came into the line of the throw, uh, which was by Khalil and the stump, uh, which was which to me is straight away obstructing the field. And I feel that the decision that was given was absolutely spot on. Uh, a batsman has to hold his line, hold his line of running, uh, which Mishra did not hold. He was running straight down. Then you can actually see him turn into the right and try and cover the stumps. And that is not allowed in the game of cricket. And I think the right decision was made. <music> to me, the run out, uh, in fact, was very straightforward. It was more about... Uh, the spirit of the game and uh, nothing more than that. Uh, the keeper was well within his rights to throw at the stump uh, at the striker's end, which it missed, and it then went on to hit the non-striker's end. And in between, we had that collision. I don't think uh, Kima Paul really intentionally came into the batsman's uh, line of running. I don't think that really happened. So uh, Delhi was within the rights to really ask for the the decision, ask for the run out. Uh, it was just a question where the umpires went up and had a chat with uh, the captain straight aside that uh, do you really want to appeal for this? Do you think that uh, you want to get someone out like that? Uh, it's more, more a request, more in the spirit of the game. But I think the law very clearly says that uh, there wasn't anything wrong done. Uh, everyone was within the rights to do what they did, which was in case, uh, in, in uh, Kima Paul's case was to try and pick the ball, which he missed. Uh, he didn't really go out of his way to obstruct the batsman. And a ball hitting the stump and Rishabh Pant was well within his rights to ask for a run out.